He does have a YouTube channel. Hi. Hey. Watch all your videos. That's amazing. What's your name? Nathan. We just got done skating the Vans Park in Huntington Beach. Your boy John and I. We're gonna get something here to eat at a Grinders. Um... Okay, so somehow Dale has never mentioned this place to me, but that is literally a fingerboard skate park that they take down for certain contests. I'm gonna try to play with it vertically and hopefully I don't get in trouble, but uh, yeah, you can tell by their desk itself, they have a craft pipe as a desk. Dale, do you mind if I get? Yeah, this is really fun, dude. It's so much easier because you don't need to pop. Oh my God. Let me get in there. All right, do you mind? You gotta learn how to use the suction. Okay, so see, this is light fingerboard hack for all you oh, yeah, poser yeah. fingerboarders out there just like me. If you go like that. Oops, excuse me. If you guys don't know what's going on, basically with a normal fingerboard, you have grip tape on it, and then you can ollie with that, and you do it like a real person. But Dale likes to put a sticker on top, blow on his finger so there's adhesive. And, <laughs> and then puts it on the sticker, and it sticks to his fingers. That's for why some reason, that's what we did at the skate shop I used to work at. Like, it's so much easier for me to do an ollie. Does. That's why this is difficult for me, because I actually like fingerboarding. I'm like not horrible at it. But yeah, here we go. What are you saying? I don't like it. Yeah, you suck. Drop in real quick. All right. I mean, I mean, drop up. <laughs> Wait, you want me to go from down here to up there? Yeah. <laughs> Should we not be doing this? Okay. Oh, okay, okay. You just don't want it. Don't get on the stool. Nose blunt to a 5 -0. Can you do that? Yeah. Bye. What a wonderfully nice place to go to, dude. All the skateboard stuff was so, it, it, dude, to have that environment where it's like, you feel me, you feel me, and then also letting us fingerboard. That whole sign that you saw that said no fingerboarding was a joke. Yeah, They're yeah, super down. And then they have contests or tournaments here for yeah. people to fingerboard, which I would never go to because of my insecurity of fingerboarding. And everybody else out there is so good at it. It's ridiculous. Dude, everybody who fingerboards crushes They're so it. good, but I do want, a, I want to build a park. Like That's I want sick. to have a little park, maybe not like that, but if I could have a few of those obstacles. It might not be that hard to build either. I feel like it wouldn't be. Guys, I am so unbelievably enthused right now. It's finally here. People have been wondering what happened to Progress Daily. And the thing is, it has been in the works for so long now because I have so many different items of clothing coming into line. Some of the line has actually shown up and I just decided 
last minute, AKA about 10 minutes ago, that I'm gonna release some of it right now. The rest of it will be here in less than a month and it was just so much that I didn't want it all to be just like bam in your face. So today, what I have here is actually something that people have been asking me for and thank you so much for giving me the drive and the motivation to go out there and try to make something of my own. I'm so happy about this. I gotta, today I am releasing the hats and the socks. I was gonna just do this artsy montage showcasing the product, but I wanted to introduce you at least to a little bit of the idea behind each product. I had to start off with a classic Progress Daily logo, but new. So right here we have a blue hat that says Progress Daily, and I'm so stoked on this colorway and there are about four different color hats that I wear every single day, so I had to make sure that I got the pink and the blue, so for Progress Daily with the crown, pink and blue. Moving on. If you watch my channel a lot, you know how hypercritical I am about thinking and trying to think outside of the box and overthinking, because people always say, you think too much about it, dude, you're overthinking it. I don't think that exists. I think thinking is what brings new ideas and it's very inspiring to me, and what symbolizes thinking, in my mind, a freaking light bulb. Boom. I love a black and white graphic pretty much more than anything else, but I love the detail involved in the light bulb itself. The hat is just a friendly reminder to think as much as possible and as innovatively as possible. Oh yeah, and just to scratch my own itch, I actually don't own a black hat, so the black version of this same hat. Same design, all black. And last but not least, we have a unique color. It's a butter hat with a navy palm trees design. They moved out of California and the palm trees represent California and all of my ambitions, everything I've been working for for so long, and it's just a fun feeling. To me, the idea of a big building or a beach sort of represent the same thing, where it's me coming out of my comfort zone and leaving my hometown to explore new, beautiful things and finding new things that have just really fueled my life. The hat is about the journey. All right, and I guess we can get to the uh, socks. So what are the two things that I say at the end of every single vlog? Progress daily and keep killing it, so of course, you already know what the socks are gonna say. Let's just pan over here. White Progress Daily Socks. And of course, what goes along well with white? Ah! Black Progress Daily Socks. This makes me so happy. I've always been a huge fan of socks. I love colored socks, I love black. I don't know, I, I love the whole industry behind socks and hats and clothes which is why I own Progress Daily. But for the next two pairs of socks, I think you're gonna be very pleasantly surprised. You know how I had the blue hat and the pink hat? Well, blue with pink. And that says, keep killing it. Those are two of my favorite colors right now. And then for the other pair of socks, the other pair of keep killing it, because I had to do two of each saying, I picked the other two of my favorite colors of shoes that I wear, so that they would match pretty much any shoe that I ever bought. And here's the final colorway cream colored with blue, keep killing it. And again, I can never thank you guys enough for helping inspire me and motivate me to be in the position that I am today to be able to make products like this. I've always been a huge, huge advocate and dreamer of being able to create my own clothing line and through this YouTube channel and through having people like you guys who support me, it's been a possibility and it's unreal. And I am 100% never the guy to take advantage of a situation like this. For me, I'm gonna keep expanding and keep growing, keep making things that I think the world wants to see and hopefully dedicate Progress Daily into doing bigger and better projects in the future as soon as possible. And for anyone out there just watching my videos, I appreciate it like crazy for you to take the time out of your day and spend time with me every single day is unreal or even sometimes of the week. If you come here at all and watch a video, it's really inspiring to me and it means a lot that you guys would care about the content that I create that much. It's been a really fun ride and yes, in less than a month, I'll be having the rest of the Progress Daily Line show up. These are the socks and the hats, but of course there are other things, all the top, you'll see. I'm so excited about you guys seeing the rest because it's a lot of stuff. And uh, this, yeah, this was just, this is like, this is a long time in the making. So it's a huge relief that this is finally out there. And from here, it's just gonna keep expanding and growing. And I love you guys for that. So happy and thankful.